you've got an instant pot but did you know there are so many more things you can do with the right accessory hey guys my name is Vanessa and today I am sharing with you the accessories that I own for my instant pot plus a few others that are still on my wish list so the Instant Pot is amazing. You can cook up so many things in it, but you can do so much more with just the right accessory. So let me go ahead, I'm gonna take you guys down, show you exactly what I own, plus a few more things. Okay, so this is the Instant Pot that I started out with two years ago. So I purchased this on Amazon Prime Day in 2016. So this will actually be the, well, in the summertime, it will be the third year that I have owned this Instant Pot. And I just barely used it the first year, but the last year and a couple months, I have been gung-ho. I love this thing, and with the accessories that I'm about to show you, I have been able to do so much more with it. So this this is my six quart. I also own this one, which is new to me just recently, last year towards the end of the year. And this is a six quart also. I have a family of six and this size works perfect for me. However, I needed to. <laughs> if you guys wanna just start out with one, that's fine, but once you start using it, you realize it's really nice to have two. It's not necessary, but I did wanna share, not necessarily an accessory, but I do loving having two Instant Pots because I can cook my main dish in here and I can also cook my veggie or my side, whatever I want. Plus, if you're using it for meal prep, you can get twice done in just as much time, so it's amazing. This one, like I said, is also a six quart. I just love the Pioneer Woman design. If you guys are new, I love the color combos and the prints that the Pioneer Woman uses. I actually shared my haul of everything that I own Pioneer Woman not too long ago, so I'll have that linked up above if you guys want to check it out. But Pioneer Woman is mainly sold at Walmart. You can find it on Amazon, but it is cheaper at Walmart. But I will have these two linked down below just in case you guys are new to the Instant Pot game and you wanna see exactly what mine entail and what mine can do. This one is, I always forget the name of it. It's like the uh, Duo 7-in-1, something like that. I just, they're six quart. <laughs> so I own two, but on top of two, let me show you guys some accessories. Okay, so the first thing that I bought after owning just the one before I got the second Instant Pot was a second inner bowl. That is because I was using it so much that if I cooked one thing in it and then I needed it to stay in the refrigerator, there are some recipes, um, I actually have one coming up where I cooked something in the Instant Pot, however it needed to cool in the refrigerator for 24 hours. So with just having one pot, I could not use my Instant Pot for the entire next day. So I went ahead and picked myself up an extra bowl that way, just in case. And if you wanted to cook two things, you could cook it, you could take that out, and then you could put your other thing in and cook it if you were cooking it that way. So I love having two pots on hand. That is definitely one of my favorite things. Okay, so the next accessory was I got some more lining rings. So if you guys did not know, you can take these out and wash them. It definitely helps with the smell. Um, and by having, I have a three pack here. I'm gonna show you guys. So I have the blue one in here because I cooked um, eggs in here, like my meal prep stuff in my Instant Pot last. So the blue one is for rice and eggs, anything that I'm not using any like extra smelly thing in, if that makes sense, when I'm just using, you know, my one cup of water, and again, mainly for eggs and rice, so that one hardly ever has a smell to it. The red one I use for desserts, and then this one is for everything savory, everything in between. So these are super easy to clean, and I just like having them differently, because I always, in the back of my mind, I feel like if I am using this ring that I use for like my meats and my sides, and I'm cooking a dessert, I'm just so afraid <laughs> that the smell on this ring is going to leak into my dessert, and I'm gonna have like, chocolate cake smelling like chicken or something. I know that's probably not gonna happen, but I love having the extra rings. Plus, again, I can take these out, and if these are you know, in my sink dirty and I haven't gotten a chance to wash them yet, which is real life, I have backups where I can still use my Instant Pot. 
Okay, so for my third like start off accessory, then we'll get into some of the funner ones, is a glass lid. Now you are going to want a glass lid if you are using your Instant Pot as a slow cooker, as a crock pot. I know that's the brand, but that's what most people use to associate slow cooking with. So if you are going to use your Instant Pot as a slow cooker, you really want the glass lid so it can release the steam naturally and all of that. Also, if you are using the saute function or browning and you're leaving your items in there for a little longer, you're gonna want this to prevent the splashing of the cooking oil and everything getting, you know, making a mess and all of that. So this, the glass lid does have the steam release vent and then the stainless steel rim. So it's awesome just for doing those extra things in your Instant Pot. So these are definitely my first three that I would suggest starting out with when it comes to accessories for your Instant Pot. Okay, now for some more of like a funner <laughs> accessory. That's what I'm going to call it. So I have no problem cooking eggs in my Instant Pot just with the trivet. And the trivet does come with your Instant Pot along with like a little plastic spoon and a little bowl. Those are actually in my dishwasher right now. Um, but that's everything that you will get with your Instant Pot. However, these you would have to buy separately. And I found this on Amazon, so I will have the link down below, but there are actually quite a few uses for this. So a lot of people use it for their eggs because I don't, they don't want it to sit on their trivet. However, I've never used this to hard boil eggs. I always just use a trivet, but I have made little pancake bites in here and I have made muffins. What else? Um, the Starbucks little egg bites, you can make egg bites in here, all sorts of things. Um, so this definitely helps you make, you know, those little bite-sized dishes that you would like to create in your Instant Pot. So this is probably my favorite accessory that I own right now. And that is this two-part little pan set that goes together. This is called pot and pot or PIP cooking. If you search that online, you can find so many different recipes. I have shared, I think just one here on this channel, although I have cooked several things in here. I'll try to find that video and I will link that as well up in the I cards. I did chicken and rice. So you're basically your whole meal just do the veggies on the side or steam them in your second instant pot, which I'm gonna get into in just a second, and then your meal is done. So I loved cooking them together. It just made cooking fast and easy, especially whether you are meal prepping or if you're doing it for lunch. I just love having this as an accessory and allowing me to cook two things at once, two different things where I don't want the flavors to miss and mix and match together, um, but it's super easy. It comes with this little holder, allows you to pull it out of your Instant Pot with no problem. And again, it is just two pots that fold into, that sit on top of one another, separating the foods that you're cooking so you can cook two things at once. I did find this on Amazon as well. I love Amazon for Instant Pot accessories. Let me tell you, it is endless the things that you can find there. So I'm gonna link everything that I'm showing you down below. Okay, and my last accessory, I don't own too many. I'm, you know, spreading it out. I do want quite a few. Is this silicone pressure cooker steamer. I have been eyeballing this. This is the only thing that I did not get on Amazon. However, I'm pretty sure it's on Amazon. Again, everything will be linked down below. I bought this at my local HEB. I kept seeing it and I just broke down and bought it. So I have never steamed veggies in my Instant Pot before. I have always cooked them with the liquid and you just, they're not as good as steaming them um, on like with a pot and a steamer on your stove. So I'm really excited to use this in my Instant Pot, but if you can see the picture there, it does have the handles for the easy pulling in and setting in there. It flexes to fit in your pressure cooker um, or in your pot. So if you don't have a pressure cooker, you can use this on the stove as well. That's awesome, so many different uses. It is heat resistant and dishwasher safe. So I am really excited to bust this open and start using it. So those are all the accessories I own. However, I have a huge list of other items I would like and some items you can use in your Instant Pot that you might already own, like a springform pan to cook cheesecake as long as it fits inside your Instant Pot with no problem, then you can use that and cook in there. Um, one thing that I would love, and I'm gonna ho hopefully it will show up, are these little Instant Pot or silicone 
um, little mitts. They're not really a full size glove. They just go on your fingers to pull the pot out. I've had to use oven mitts before and I just, I don't know. I like the silicone. I do not have any silicone oven mitts or, you know, heat resistant mitts. So that's on my list for the instant pot. Another accessory I would love to own, and actually this is just like the Springform pan, it's not just for the Instant Pot, I can use it in so many things, is an immersion blender that has been on my wish list for a very long time. And the last accessory, these are the top three on my list. Like I said, I have quite a few, but the last one is that little cute guy that you can sit on your vent for when you're steaming so you can direct the steam wherever you want um, so it's not just going straight you can direct it off to the side and you don't have to worry about it messing up your cabinets or having to pull it out or anything like that you can have it tucked back and still the steam is coming out the side I am definitely wanting one of those so if you guys have any accessories for your instant pot that I have not mentioned that you absolutely love let us all know down below or if there's something that I haven't mentioned that is on your wish list let everybody know that down down below because as an instant pot lover I am always looking for new meals that I could create using just the right tool or accessory so if you guys like this video give it a big thumbs up I hope it was very helpful for you guys again I will have some links down below if you guys want to check them out subscribe if you are new every single Wednesday even though this is going up on a Thursday if you guys know, I have a vlog channel and my life is a little hectic right now. So this week was definitely, it got me off schedule, but typically every single Wednesday is going to be an instant pot video. Um, so subscribe and hit that bell if you want to be notified and don't want to miss any more instant pot information. So if you guys are here for the instant pot videos, I will see you next Wednesday, but I will be back tomorrow cleaning my kitchen. It is pretty dirty. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.